Hey everybody, we're back in the shop with the uh, Coyote tractor. Another little update about what's been going on. This morning we put the back tires on. On the weekend we put some front tires on. Uh, the hood, I put the top on this morning and uh, we're wiring some LED lights. Take a little walk around here. We did a lot of rebuilding down on the bottom of the rad support. Uh, had a lot of rust. So uh, we put that together on the weekend, put uh, some primer and some paint. Got the brand new tires on. These front tires are skid steer tires. They're 17 and a half by 24, 14 ply. They're a pretty, pretty tough tire. I got a new step put on by the fuel tank. And the rear tires we put on this morning. Those rear tires are 18.4 by 24. And their industri industrial thread, tread tire, um, I might cut the lugs up afterwards. I've read a few treads that say online that say you should cut them there, uh, get, sipe, sipe them or cut them. They're not too good on traction on, on snow and mud apparently, so we might do some cutting on those a little later. I uh, put the windshield on and the, the small windows there in the cab. We'll put the doors on this afternoon and the back windows. Like I say, we put the, the top on this morning. And we're installing some brand new LED lights in the back and the front. On the weekend, the rear fenders went on, the flares and the rear tail lights. It's looking pretty good. Got a lot of shine to it. It's going to look like a brand new tractor. DK65S, Coyote, 65 horsepower. We've got the grill on this morning and the headlight. I went on YouTube and researched the uh, how to polish the headlight. The headlight had turned yellow, had a yellow tint to it. You couldn't see it, so uh, I did a wet sand and a polish. YouTube's great for that stuff. You can go on and just about find out anything that you want. To, uh, to do that you don't have any experience on. That's why I like making these videos. Maybe I, it'll help somebody out somewhere that's rebuilding a tractor or fixing one up. A uh, little bit of knowledge goes a long way. Yeah, so that's it. Still got the exhaust pipe to uh, put a tip on. There's the tip. That goes on the top there. I don't want it to go any higher than the roof so the branches don't catch up. We'll weld that up and give it a nice coat of flat black paint. We'll see how that looks. Well, this week we should have her running and out of the shop. We're hoping anyway. All right. If you like these videos, uh, don't be afraid to subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button and share them with your friends. Talk to you later.